Good morning, everyone. I want to thank Representative Stone uh, for your leadership on this important issue. I am State Representative Brian Elder, uh, and I represent the City of Bay City and the surrounding areas in the 96th District, and also serve as the Chair of the Michigan Legislative Labor Caucus. As Michiganders, we know the meaning of hard work better than anyone, because it was the working people of this state who helped to give birth to the American middle class. For decades, our working class jobs provided a rubric for other states to follow, including strong wages that kept up with the cost of living and good benefits that ensured folks could take care of themselves and their families when building a future. Despite the opposition of corporate CEOs and well-connected millionaires, hundreds of thousands of Michiganders joined together last year to reaffirm our commitment to strong wages and good benefits through two statewide petitions. But in response, Republican-led legislature took an unprecedented step of subverting the will of our people by adopting the One Fair Wage and My Time to Care initiatives only to gut them during lame duck. They stole from our people who were simply fighting for Michigan values, the values that our state was built upon. Fair wages and the right to care for themselves and their loved ones without risking their job or their economic security. My colleagues and I believe that Michiganders deserve better than to be robbed of their chance to make their vote count by the very people sent to Lansing to fight for them. And I know that most Michiganders feel exactly the same way. So when political games and personal interests stand in the way of our voters making their voices heard, it's now our duty to stand up and say enough. Not for ourselves, but for the working family just trying to put food on the table. For parents needing to take time off from work to care for a child who is sick, and for all Michiganders getting left behind by partisan tricks. The people of our state should have a powerful voice, and it's time for us to listen and give them what they want.